Hey guys, we are in Calgary, Alberta at Champions Creed Martial Art with Mean Hakeem, up and coming MMA, UFC, superstar fighter. Tell us what we're at, what we're doing. We're at Champions Creed uh, Mixed Martial Arts. Uh, this is, you know, my MMA gym, head coach Brian Bird. Um, we've produced other UFC fighters like Nick Ring and of course including myself. I'm getting ready for my up and coming belt September 26th on Fight Island against uh, Zibaru and I'm planning another big knockout in that 50k bonus. That's amazing. Well, I think he's going to put in some rounds. Stay tuned. See what we got going on. That was amazing. It is incredible to see the work and dedication that this man put in. I, he just went round for round for round. I'm more tired holding the camera than he was doing the work. Just tell us a little bit about what's going on, your journey, what, where you're at in your life right now. Uh, yeah, today's just a typical day. We do uh, nine five minute rounds. Um, I'm used to this work rate. This is just a regular Saturday for me. After this, I'm probably gonna do some strength and conditioning. Um, you know, I just wanna think about my trading partners coming out, giving me the work giving me uh, you know some uh, some different looks and you know trying their best to you know uh, give me the best rounds possible awesome so any advice for anybody aspiring to kind of make it to the show how to how much work and dedication does it take to get to these places you know it takes a lot of dedication it's uh it's not a hobby it's a lifestyle you know you can't just uh you can't just be an athlete at the gym you gotta be an athlete at home you gotta be an athlete 24 7 you know what i mean so if you want to get into the big leagues you, you better be training you know six five days a week three times a day sticking to your diet and uh you know just getting the toughest work possible i go around you know, different cities, trying to find different sparring partners, the best sparring partners to push me. I, I, I box boxers, I'll go against wrestlers, I'll go against jiu-jitsu guys. And uh, you know, I'm just always competing against the best in the caliber. And uh, if you want to make it to the big leagues, you just got to be dedicated and you got to be tough. And you got to be willing to do whatever it takes. Don't pick your fights. Take those tough fights. That's what's going to get you in the big leagues. And just one last question. Martial arts is so impactful for so many people. I just want to talk a little bit about how martial arts has changed your life and what it's done for you. Yeah, martial arts has done a lot for me. You know, uh, before you know, before I was in martial arts, I was in juvie, so kind of like a Mike Tyson story. You know what I mean? I, I got uh, luckily I got out on, on probation on a, a program that allowed me to write off my martial arts training as anger management, which allowed me to get off house surveillance and probation and house arrest and stuff like that. So martial arts changed my whole life, taught me discipline, um, it gave me purpose 
has got me off the streets. And, uh, you know, I'm just very grateful that I found it. Well, he is an up-and-coming superstar. You will be seeing him. Just tune in, TSN, anywhere. We'll catch you guys later. September 26th. Fight Island. I'm gonna knock out another Dagestani. It'll be my second time. Mean King.